thousands to flight. One man in that day when we get our power go and chase a thousand men. Two gone for ten thousand to flight. That God likes that us. Think about that right now. He's so working on technology to, to get that kind of technology right now to make suits and give men injection to get that kind of power. But we go and have it naturally. Understand? He's so, he's so working on technologies and ways to, 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 to combat against uh, angels and fight against the Lord and fight against we when we get in power. But we go and have it naturally to put one man to fly. One man go put 10,000 men to fly. 10,000, uh, so like, yeah, two men go put 10,000 men to flight. Alright? That is, that, is, that is what, um, when you have a bar, show me how we give you that. That increase, that what we're going to do. I want to hear. That's okay? Yeah. This is Psalms 144, 1 and 2. It says, Blessed be Yahweh, my strength, which teacheth my hands to war, and my fingers to fight, my goodness, and my fortress, my tower, and my deliverer. My shield and he whom I trust, whom subdueth my people under. Yeah, that is what the Lord will do for you. He will teach me hands to fight. We go in and learn and pick up sticks and go in and carry to school. <laughs> you know? We go in and do that. When, when that spiritual power from on high descend upon the men who you have about Shami and Shai or they need to, he saw you in serious trouble. But they like um, this movie, Limitless. Limitless, when you take the pill. He didn't have to learn karate. Mm -hmm. all, the, all the karate movies he watched through the years, all are because there's like, there's really say data about the race, they always stored. Mm -hmm. So like all the karate movies he seen through the years, it was always in the brain. So when he take that pill, they just recollected back to him. Oh, well, and guess what? He know what to do. Right. You understand? He know what to do. Right. And scripture said, most times a man of war, when you think about it in a sense, think about it in a sense, the way how the most high genetically made us up is for his spirit to basically dwell in us. That is why we're supposed to abstain from certain unclean meat or the cases because our body actually built to um, inhabit the spirit of the most high. Yeah. You understand? And his spirit is what teaches us to do what we do. Like how we teach teaching us the doctrine right now to fight our spiritual war warfare. You understand? And the time coming that we're going to get physical. Yeah. Like we say that um, Lord, I just really, they just might come back to your mind. You understand? Like if all them cards you will be a watcher, you might just come back and you just know it too. Uh -huh. The second Ezra chapter 14, verse 14. And I took it and drank. And when I drank of it, my heart uttered understanding, and wisdom grew in my breast, for my spirit strengthened my memory. Uh -huh. You understand? I want to This is um Jude. Jude 1 5, I will therefore put you in remembrance, though you once knew this. Right? So, so it's not that we once knew, but most of it is going back in remembrance as we don't know. Because we once knew these things even in three times. Um, back in three spirits in our country. Uh, Isaiah 59 verse 19, it says, So shall they fear the name of the Lord from the west, and his glory from the rising of the sun. When the enemy shall come in like a flood, the Spirit of the Lord shall raise up the standard against him. The enemy comes standing like a pushing back. Stand up force. Just like with um, when they come in the garden against them, and Yahweh shall himself be seeking. And they fall back. That was like you just was amazed. That was the force of the Lord. When the other is there, the other is there, Yahweh shall not be seeking. Yes, sir. Yeah, so think about it, we actually have to be some more supernatural. So like, alright, or you just fall back because he had met the sea. No, it has to be something else. They are shy and move it. Like, no, you like them, them though. Yeah. Take me alone. <laughs> Push them back. Now why you say, hey, you take me. I lay my life down. Lay my life down. Exactly, you know. Like, what do you say? Say, please, sir. Say, I don't 
This is Isaiah chapter 41 verse 14. Fear not the worm Jacob and ye men of Israel. I will help thee, saith Yahweh, and thy Redeemer, the Holy One of Israel. Behold, I will make thee a new treasure instrument having teeth. Thou shalt stretch the mountains and beat them small, and shall make the hills as sharp. Scripture say that, hey, you say you want to make a new sharp instruction instrument having teeth. And that don't mean an Israelite going and play a sharp instruction instrument having teeth. Like a man. Like you can take a man and you want to be a sharp instrument. No. Like in Naruto, uh, they take this fella and take him into a staff. And you can't die. Not like that. Not like that. Monkey, I think they show that some way Monkey King to where they take a man to him. Nah, it's not like that. Not like that. That you want to get spiritual power that when we come and go through with the mic, it's like that, that one be effect after we don't go through. It's like. It's like. It's like. It's like. It's like. It says Micah 5 verse 7. And the remnant of Jacob shall be in the midst of many people as they drew from Yahweh. As the showers upon the grass that tarry not for man, nor waited for the sons of men. And the remnant of Jacob shall be among the Gentiles in the midst of many people as a lion among the beasts of the forest. As a young lion among the flocks of sheep. That's how they always shall go in and be that day. You go in and be as a young lion in the flock of sheep. You know what? A young lion does the power and go through. A young lion. You see a young lion can lay up to what? 50 times a day or more? You understand? A young lion can lay up to 50 times a day or more. So now how much energy a young lion have? And a sheep. A sheep. The sheep will be a nation. Right now we the sheep for the Iranian to pray on we. But in that day we go and be like lion and then go and be the sheep. This is uh they say that the remnant of Jacob shall be in the midst of the jet shall be among the Gentiles. The start, same Gentiles, them Christian teaching that I'm seeing. In the midst of many people as the young lion, the beast of the forest, as the young lion among the flocks of sheep. Who if you go through, go through it down and tear it in pieces and none can deliver. None can deliver. Nobody will be able to deliver you uh, and Gentiles in that day. And like the actual Gentiles, then you the Israelite for Like the actual Gentiles. Nobody will be able to deliver you in that day. You understand? You will be destroyed and the Gentiles is known as this. God. <laughs> this is our Numbers 23. I'll start at verse 24. It says, Behold, I have received commandment to bless, and he had blessed, and I, and I cannot reverse it. He had not beheld iniquity in Jacob, neither had he seen perverseness in Israel. It says, The how about Shamiel Shai, the most high power, is with him, and a shout of a king is among them. The most high brought them out of Egypt. He had, he had as it were, the strength of a unicorn. Surely there is no enchantment against Jacob, neither is there any divination against Israel. According to this time, it shall be said of Jacob and of Israel, What hath the Mosai wrought? Behold, the people shall rise up as a great lion, and lift up himself as a young lion. He shall not lie down until he eat of the prey and drink the blood of the slain. Hey, it says, um, That's the point of the line. Just the line of It says, verse 24, number 23, verse 24. Behold, the people shall rise up as a great lion and lift up themselves as a young lion. And who we waiting on? The lion and the tribe of Judah, Yahweh Shah. But when, 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 when he when he said trash is the trash, Jeremiah yeah. 48 and 10, he said, Cursed be he that holds back his word from blood. You understand? When the lion and the tribe of Judah said, Go and, 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 and trash is the trash. And, and he's going to make him men like lions. 
You understand? Like young Kia styles ready to just devour and conquer everything in front of the way. You understand? That is how we made that going on these that day. It says, he shall not lie down until he eat of the bread and drink the blood of the slave. Yeah, he's going on, he's going on totally devour you so far white people, you Chinese people, you East Indians, all right? You Hamites, all of you are going to be our slaves. We going to actually drink your blood either. That is against the law. Understand? We're going to totally take you over. We're going to be a kings in that day. The nation of Israel. The so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. You're looking at your future kings. That's right. That's right. <clears throat> Micah 3, verse 13, and 4, verse 13. My bad. Arise and trash, O daughter of Zion. For I will make thy horn iron and I will make thy hooks brass, and thou shalt beat in pieces many people, and I will consecrate their gain unto the Lord, and their substance unto the Lord of the whole earth. Right. So, hey, you are beat in pieces many people. Many people. That is, that is what you, you people just standing up outside here, so just for so. We want to see you are a nation's faith. That's right. And the things that they don't have for the all, all, all the injustice and people we show, all the, all the hell. Yeah, we catch it over here on the side. That's we right. want to see a faith. That is why we standing up outside here. As we read the scripture earlier, we prisoners are hope. This is the hope you open for. To see a go down and we come up. That's you understand? To see you on now we feast for what? Right. This is Revelation 2, 25 going down. But that which ye have already will fast till I come. And he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end. To him will I give power over the nations, and he shall rule them with a rod of iron. With a rod of iron. He that keepeth my works and overcome. Not just anybody. Not the scripture is said to, to do the works for two years and just follow. Alright? The scripture said to endure and overcome. And that man, what is it? What is it what that man? It says, and he um, shall rule them with a rod of iron. With them they're talking about the other nations. Alright, the so-called white man at the head of you. Alright, the Chinese, the Arabs, with all the gold right now. We're going and rule you Arabs with a rod of iron. Khan. Alright, all your gold, your, all your gold and one savior. You rock shines all your gold and one savior. All, that, all the things they have in one savior. We going and be the rulers of the earth. So the big and everything else. When you look up um rod of iron in revolution. It says what? With a rod of iron indicates the severest, <laughs> most rigorous rule. <laughs> a severe and rigorous rule, <laughs> but in righteousness. <laughs> you either might did it in wickedness, you want to do it in righteousness. You want to be severe and rigorous to you in the right way. Because you don't have to keep the law. You're talking about the good, right? This is 1 Kings chapter 20 verse 3. Thy silver and thy gold is mine. Thy wives also and thy children. Even the goodless are mine. Done. Done. I silver and gold is the most I own. I have a strong I own. So the scripture saying um Sirach chapter 10 verse 8. Because of injuries and, and riches done by the city kingdom is translated from one people to the next. No, he was talking about the other body money. He said he gave you plastic money to play with now. Right. But guess what? That was actually a calculated step by the whole side. Because think about everybody had gold playing around with you. Then that would have been more work for us to collect it. <laughs> but when you learn how, a certain group of people collecting all the gold, it makes it easier. Yeah, you right. understand? One place. You understand? <laughs> That's one place. Let's go one place. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. And, and guess what? We are step through that one day. Also, our next thing, because we are we are the most high. Like, what treasure? We are his Christ We are his wife. You understand? And guess what? He done a nation structure, and the most high don't want no ransom. Neither we want. You understand? This is Proverbs six, verse um, thirty-four. It says. For jealousy is the rage of a man, 
Therefore, he will not spare in the day of vengeance. He will not regard any ransom. Neither will he rest content. No, don't give us many gifts. You understand? So, we is the wife. 